Hey y'all, what's up? Uh, Smitty here. Um, okay, now I seen the video where Versus was talking about how um, the rating system for 2K football is basically one and done, and how if Batbreaker were to use it, it would hinder it because the system, the 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 uh, ability rated tier system using the three star method would not help, but only hurt it. You know, or it's limited to only one season and there can't be progression with it. That I have to fully disagree with. Because, and this is the reason why. Because, first of all, if you have a player, like, first of all, like, just to say this. 2K Sports, they did not tailor these abilities to be done for multi-year seasons. You know, as a cycle through them. Like, they, these are all tailored just for one season because that's how they set it up they set it up so then you'll play just one season now was that a flaw was that a hindrance yes it should have been a franchise mode in it but but this could have been used for multi-year seasonal play i mean this is not something that had to be just one year and um backbreaker could definitely use something along these lines um and this is why now, in his example, he took a cornerback that was generic, that had no rating at all, in comparison to a, 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 another cornerback that was a gold star. So, obviously, they had um, a decent number of abilities. Now, let's just say, for that non-star player, let's just say, like you said, he has a Pro Bowl season. He has a Pro Bowl season... What they could have, what now? Let's just say, let's just say, if they had a franchise mode in two K, uh, in two K eight, or if Backbreaker chose to say, "Hey, we're going to use the exact same setup, the exact same abilities that two K eight use in their football game." Well, then what they can do is, in terms of the secondary, let's say, let's say, if that player is having a Pro Bowl season so far, what he can do is. It can be, it, he can unlock, like, let's say if he's making multiple picks. If he, if he's, like, by the time, uh, halfway through the season or what have you, he's picked off multiple passes or what have you, he can, he can, uh, all of a sudden, he'll be able to earn, he'll earn an attribute or he'll earn a bronze ability, you know, he'll earn the bronze star rating and then he'll, all of a sudden, he'll have, he'll be a ball hawk, you know what I'm saying? He'll, he'll be a ball hawk, you know, or what have you. And he'll be able to pick up, you know, like he'll he'll be real good when it comes to covering the pass and able to pick off, able to pick off plays, you know what I'm saying? Or he can, he'll be clutch, you know, depending upon his performance, you know what I'm saying? And what you can do is you can take all these ratings that they have in this game, all these ratings, and you can, you can tier them in the sense that, you can level up. You can do them by level. Like let's say there's there's um, four or five levels, three or four levels of ball hawk. You know what I'm saying? So if he does well and he's picking passes off or what have you, or he's doing he's he, he's real good at closing in the gap on on a uh, on a defender or what have you, or I mean on on a uh, wide receiver or something like that, he can t he can level up. And it's all based upon how he's performing according to the ability that he's earned. You know what I'm saying? And in contrast, just like you said, what if the goal player doesn't perform, then what would happen is he leveled down. And he may lose certain abilities. He may level down to the point where he'll lose an ability or two because he didn't truly perform. You see what I'm saying? So, or the, or the ability would just level down. So he won't be as good at hawking the ball or as good at at playing at playing bump and run coverage you know what I'm saying or reach tackling or reading or or uh, reading the run or their closing speed or delivering a big hit you know like it, it it all depends like if if he's not tackling like he would his he'll he'll level you know he'll level down you know what I'm saying he may like they may you may have a gold player that may be at level three big hit and because he's not playing up to up to his true potential, he'll he'll level down. You know, he'll lose a level or what have you. 
or if player gets or if a player gets injured, if he has an arm injury, like if it's a quarterback, if he has an arm injury or what have you. You know, like if he has a serious arm injury, like a shoulder injury or something like that, he may not have that quick release for a good while. And it'll take him a while to gain that back. Like he may lose this attribute, but he'll still have pocket presence. You see what I'm saying? Or he still may be a pass threat. Or if he starts to throw, you know, if he's throwing more interceptions or what have you, then all of a sudden, you know, like, he'll he'll lose, his rating will decrease when it comes to him being a pass threat, you know, or having a rocket arm. Like, he'll lose some, he'll lose some of his ability to throw, to throw a long-range bomb, you know what I'm saying, because he get, because of an injury, a serious injury that he may have. Or even if it's minor, it still is going to play a role like if he's if he's out for uh, uh, an extended duration of time, the ability will decrease to the point where once again he can possibly lose it, or he'll just go down a level or so. So, and and that also plays in terms of players aging. You know, as players get older, their ability the ability to like for a receiver the the ability for them to make those acrobat acrobatic catches they won't be able to do it the same way that they used to because of injuries and just because of their age you know like you can work it out it can be worked out you know what i'm saying and this is just for me just being just one person i'm not on anyone's development team i'm not on i'm not i don't work for anybody's company you know what i'm saying i'm not with 2k i'm not with ea or anyone so just think if you have a team of people and they actually gave thought to even something, even to an idea like what I'm saying, you know, and you take it and you modify it, you can use it. It can you can take this system and implement it to into a franchise and use it to carry out year after year after year. Where you can have generic players and they can actually build up to being a bronze player and then build up to being a silver or a gold player, depending upon Depending, um, depending upon what kind of achievements that they accomplished during the during the season, you know what I'm saying. I mean, depending upon how they perform in terms of the O line or whatever. Like, if you're, if if they if they've done a great job at blocking the run multiple games, you know, like if they, it like also like this, like with Stonewall, like Lyman is such a stall, such a such a, a stalwart that. The quarterback is extra composed around them. I mean, you know, those are the kind of things like when you're performing like that, you may be a clutch blocker or a better leader. You know, these are these are all things that you can start off at a level one, depending upon what they've done or how good of a job they've done. Players can you have some players that'll that'll uh, develop from nothing and come up to a silver or come up to be a gold star if they if they perform above and beyond the call of duty you know what i'm saying so this is something that can honestly be implemented into a franchise and used efficiently it's just a matter of people it's just a matter of these companies just expanding their horizon and thinking a bit outside the box and you definitely can do it i just gave it some outside thought and this is what you can do i mean because that's realistic as players get older they lose their ability they they lose some things but they retain others you know what i'm saying they 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 lose all the over the top or the exceptional ability that they had but then they're able to stick to their textbook fundamental skills that they had that all that'll keep them around until they get you know really up there in age you know what i'm saying so um so i just had to make that point you know what i'm saying like this is this is a very efficient system and i have full faith that the people over there natural motion will know what they're doing and not to worry about it i mean you know i wouldn't worry about it like that it is a concern it is something to think about but i mean none of us have played a demo none of us work for natural motion none of us have even all we've seen is videos and read articles so to jump that far out there you know is a is a little bit much you know in terms of what backbreaker is going to do we just have to sit back and wait and see because they've only said a little bit about what the rating system is they only said that they were using the three star tier system and they only spoke about maybe three or four different abilities in terms of what players are being rated on 
So until then, let's just wait, sit back, relax, and just see what it is that they're going to do. We'll see when the demo comes out, and then we'll all be able to truly get a, get a feel for what it is that this game is truly going to be about. So let's just wait and see what happens.